the Irishman in the Cherries goal, the 20-year-old making his third Premier League start. 1-0 win over Spurs and a 5-3 victory over Palace and Pratt Travers has lost the ball there, he's played it straight to Saar and now Saar drives it in, we talk about mistakes and Watford have made Bournemouth pay for one. Abdullah Decore the scorer. Travers gave possession away, it worked back in the penalty area and the Frenchman Decore just before half-time scores his third of the season and it's Bournemouth nil, Watford won. Well, you have to say that that was self-inflicted. The ball given away by the goalkeeper. They are happily passing, pick their way round, and now Saar with a break away from Steve Cook. Men to pull it back to if Saar can find one. Sells Cook a dummy, knocks it in towards the near post. Deeney lashes it in, and Watford have a two-goal lead. Troy Deeney, a man they find hard to keep a lock on, has a say again at the Vitality Stadium. Bournemouth defensively in disarray once more, and Deeney makes them pay. 2-0. Well, he seems to save his best moments to Odini for games against Bournemouth. To give us your verdict, as Lewis Cook left it and Pereira just carried on, there's an opportunity in the middle here for Andre Gray to put it beyond any doubt. Chance comes in across the goal, cleared off the line by Fraser brilliantly. Pereira shot, it is 3-0, all over. Roberto Pereira sums up the afternoon as the ball pings around in the box. The Cherries double over onto their knees. Watford fans are all arms and legs in that away fan. It's 3-0 to Watford. Well, Fraser got back and cleared one off the line. I know he done it, it was fantastic, but...